Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Marília Takada. I'm a Nikkei Sensei Brazilian, and I'm here to introduce you a Nikkei project held in my country named Grupo Nikkei. I'm living here in Japan as a JICA scholarship program and to study veterinary medicine. So, uh, Grupo Nikkei is a non profit organization. It was founded 10 years ago by Mrs. Leda Shimabukoro in São Paulo City. And here's the picture. This is her and her husband, Paulo Shimabukoro. Both of them are responsible for this project. So, the Nikkei Group's goal is to help unemployed people to support them. Um, as you all may know, the lack of jobs is a big issue in developing countries such as Brazil. And when we think about unemployment in Brazil, we're talking about an unemployment rate of 9%. This number represents inside the empty population around 200,000 people that is looking for job but they cannot find a job. So, Grupo Nikkei has two main projects. Uh, one project is an employment project that anyone can join, any age, any social condition, educational level. And the other project is the Daima project that has focus on ex decasis So, I first would like to talk about the employment project. The first part is a human resource lecture held by headhunter Marcus Hanyu. He, uh, he will give advice about uh, what the employer is usually looking for and he will give tips about how to go, to go well in the interview session. And the second part is, uh, well, when the candidates come to Group Nikkei, they have to fill a form and tell, tell us about their profile, their uh, life experiences, the educational level, their hobbies. So when we have their profile, we try to match it to some job space that were offered by some private company. And with that, by the time of the interview, we can talk to them and try to find more about the capacity and the potential and try to offer the best job space for them. So after the interview, they can go for look for this private company and holding a recommendation letter of Grupo UK, we can schedule an interview and talk to them and try to make a deal. But if something does not work out uh, in some part, this person data, uh, personal data will go to Grupo Nikkei's database and so this person can still count on this institution as a channel to find a job by the daily assistant uh, of the institution. Um, so the second project, Tadaima project, is focused on ex decasegui. So the aim of this project is to work on the emotional issues, the uh, adapting phase that this group of people have to pass when they go back to Brazil. And the first part of Tadaima project is a self-knowledge lecture held by Renato Botwain. Um, he will bring back some experience of of this that this group of people went through in Japan and so they can understand more about their emotions and to improve the self-concept. The second part is a group dynamic session held by Lie Matsumoto Kawa. Uh, because, this, because of this group of people went through so many difficulties in Japan and when they go back to Brazil they have to face with a lot of other difficulties such lack of job, uh, low salary, and another like, different lifestyle they have to get used to. Sometimes they uh, can present low self-esteem, so this session will work on this issue. Um, and after that, they all go to the interview part. 
In 2007, the Brazilian population living in Japan was around 317,000 people. And the first semester of 2009, this year, this number decreased 13%. Economic crisis effect was also felt by Group Nikkei because the number of people who were looking for support doubled the number and also the extra cafes percentage doubled. Since January to May of this year. Uh, about the achievements, uh, Almost 12,000 people joined the unemployment project so far and inside this group around 3,300 people were ex the and 2,300 around this number were successful recruitment. They got a job. Uh, the group in the case were, was showing some media in Brazil major newspapers, TV channels, also in Japanese media, and also some institutions recognize its work, Hotel International, OAB, that's a lawyer association, and many others. Um, so, the group in the it exists because of work of many people, many volunteers, now it counts around 300 volunteers, and people who care about other people and, and want to make a difference. And beside this group of volunteers, Group NK also depends on external donations and private companies that offer job spaces. So I'll finish leaving the contact of Group NK, the website, and also my email address. I cannot be here in the real time, so I would be glad to answer questions by email. Thank you very much for your attention.